Dynamark, get ready, he's it, go. Dark. Kelly's here. Wow. Kelly's here. Perfect. Gaming. That's amazing. I thought your genuine laugh, I thought to me was hilarious because I was like, oh, that's a really fun way of doing that actually. I really like that. I was not trying to make fun of you at all. <laughs> I thought it was genuinely funny. I really wanted to actually do that again. <laughs> I'm glad you found some humor out of that. Ha ha hee hee hoo hee ha ho. That was some good stuff. Oh my goodness. Welcome back everyone to another episode of Pokemon Scarlet. I'm Kelly. I'm Zelly. And we're gaming here today, folks. In the finale of Pokemon Scarlet. Thank you guys for joining us through this whole journey here. Uh, last time, what did we do, Kelly? Do you remember what we did last time? Let's see, we beat the Elite Four, right? Yeah. Yes, we beat the Elite Four. We we faced the assessment against uh, Rika. Uh, we beat Poppy, the little kid, the little entry kid into Smithereens. We faced up against the second job, Larry, um, from the Elite Four as well. And then we finally beat Hassel, the old man who couldn't hear for anything. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> And then finally, we got to feast uh, La Primera, or Gita, is the is the champion for Pokemon. So we're able to claim the champion title ourselves, and now we ourselves are champions in Pokemon Scarlet. Does that feel good, Kelly? Yeah, it feels real good. <laughs> so we're gonna do champion stuff with our champion friend Nimona over here. So today this episode, we're gonna be facing Nimona as a champion. We'll certainly go see Arden as well, and then if there's anything else to kind of pick up and explore more in the world of Paldea, we'll do just that. Let's start off things with saying hi to our friends, Nomona and the Mesagoza here. And if you guys noticed, I bought myself a new hat. And. Ooh. Oops. Oh, I like that. I like, I got a new phone case. It's the fairy case. You can go to the Deli Bird Presents place and buy phone cases. Hey, was that planned out? It looks like it matches your backpack and your hat and your phone. Oh, yeah, totally planned, Jelly. Are you also a fashion master as well, Kelly? Mm, no, I would just like to coordinate. You're not a fashion master? No, I'm not a oh. fashion master. Okay. Can I, like... Oh. Any second now. I've been waiting here ah, for five days. There you are, Kelly. You ready for a battle between champions? Because all these folks here seem ready to watch. Word got around, I guess. <laughs> hey, even the Elite Four's here. And out of every single person gathered here, I'm the most excited by a mile. Oh, really? The stage is set. It's my all-out power versus your strength in full fruit. Let's see who comes out on top. I'm so glad I got a new outfit. Mm -hmm. I love Nimona's battle theme music the most in this game. And this one by far is my favorite. You are challenged by champion Nimona. Awesome. Let's go. Let's go, Nimona. Lycanroc. Ooh, interesting choice, Kelly. Finally, the thing I've waited all this time for. Time to begin our greatest battle of all. You got it. <laughs> Ooh, avoided the attack, all right. I think Lycanroc is a ground type. Stealth Rock, good choice of move. Oh, that's right, your next five moves will be in power, I think. Mm -hmm. Let's use Discharge. More Rockies. Avoided the attack, wow. They're looking at evasion of life tosses. Whoa. Finally doesn't attack. I'd say. But no match for Electros. See, like a rock. Does this sound like like a rock? Pokemon Warm, that's a steel type. We're gonna switch Pokemon. It is. Hound him, good choice. Honestly, the warm one is so good. Oh, you know, it reminds me of the warm from SpongeBob. <laughs> it's like this gigantic warm that essentially like is close to the town. <laughs> yeah. Must eat everything. <laughs> He's so cute and tiny. Well, those stealth rocks do a lot, surprisingly. Bye, Orthworm. Orthworm, sorry, man. 
We fried. To think I helped teach you type matchups and now you're using them to put the hurt on me. Yeah, I'm taking you down, Nimona. There can only be one champion here today, Nimona. Let's see, comment. That's an electric type. Mm hmm. You could probably use Garchomp. Oh, that's true. He has ground type moves, which would probably be effective against that. I mean, I, I've been studying up. I've been going to Naranja Academy to study up on my ground types and metals. Palmont. Use Palmont for a bit. I did, actually. Mm -hmm. <laughs> dig. Dig, Garchomp, <laughs> dig. Awesome. Would it have been great if Dig didn't work sometime for whatever reason? The ground you Ooh, couldn't burrow into. We used Ice Punch. That was a good champ to actually do Dig, Kelly. Good choice. Awesome. There you go. Oh, yes. And actually, I realized that the electric field went away too. I wonder if he was using an electric type move if his would have been empowered. Let's see, I don't Udra. know. I don't, I, don't, um, I don't know which one that is. It sounds like a water type something or other. Oh, it's this one. This one's a dragon type. So, Dragon Claw. Yeah! Oh, it survived by one! That's not gonna be good for us either. No. no. And we're out. How do you like my real hard hits? Man, it feels good to finally let loose. I'd say so. Dang, Nimona, go easy on us. You'll probably take out Corbin Knight, yeah. yeah. You're, just, you're probably faster than that one is, hopefully, so then you don't get an ice attack. Oh, come on, you're floating. How could the stones bite into you? Come on, Corviknight. Hit, hit it. Yeah, there we go. Right in the belly button. Who do I faint? I don't know. Dunsparce. You Dunsparce. Um, I'm pretty sure Dunsparce is a ground type Pokemon. Yeah. Oh, is it Dun Dunsparce? It's the evolution of Dunsparce, but do Dunsparce. I don't know how to feel about it. What do you think, Kelly? I don't know, it kind of looks weird. I was kind of hoping Dunsparce would have like a cooler evolution, to be honest. <laughs> Besides just like an extension to its body. Yeah, let me just extend my body. <laughs> <laughs> How does Power Trip work? Like that. Because you don't do a whole lot when you use it. I don't think it's a very powerful attack. I think it's just there. Oh, okay. Well, the Gunsparce's, like, normal physical abilities are getting stronger. Hyper drill. It's not very effective. Look at that. Fury attack. I think your most effective move, yeah, was probably still I think. Yeah, probably. But the stats on Do Gunsparce have risen so much. I don't know what's going to happen to It's not very effective, but it took a cool Corviknight, though. Yeah. Oh, man, what do you think? Um... Matilda? Yeah, Matilda. 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 Again, we're floating out of those rocks. Let's do crunch. Think about out of crime. Flinch? Flinch? Nope. Uh-oh. A new Dragon Rush 2? Oh. Come on, Matilda, do another It time. hung in there. Awesome. There you go, Kelly. Nice. Is it, are we done our last one? No, Skilly Dirge. Mm, I'm gonna switch. Yeah, probably a good choice. Maybe find an opening you can use. Uh, it's all down to this, my last Pokemon. We're gonna fight with everything we've got. Ooh, all right. Skilly Dirge. Uh, I didn't realize how many of your Pokemon are actually flying. Shine, blazing bright, my greatest treasure. Ooh, look at that smile. The smile of victory. Come on, Nimona, one more. 
Nice chandelier. Wait, did they take a hit? Did the town flood take a hit? I didn't. I didn't. I didn't. I don't know. Okay. I don't know to be honest. I'm so confused because I saw him at like half HP. I'm like, I don't think the stones did all that. Who knows? Maybe I'm wrong. Get ready to see how strong Skildredge has grown since the day we all met. He was a different Pokemon. Let's be real. Not very effective. I'm gonna terrorize too. You're terror for me? I mean, terror still eyes is easy. There, you can fly even better now. Yeah, with my balloon hat. <laughs> <laughs> Acrobatics! I think two more hits and you'll probably be in good. Oh, right, it took a hit from Torch Song. I'm like, why is it going good? Acrobatics, let's go! If you can survive another attack, I think you might be able to take him out. Last one more attack. Of course, you might because it's a fire type move. It's fire. Nope. No. It did not last that last attack. Uh oh. <sighs> Sorry, Tail Flame. <laughs> you weren't strong enough. He was such a good bird. He flew where he wanted to. <sighs> I was going to say that or Hound Doom because Hound Doom is the same fire element type of that. Yeah, Electros is the new Gallade. So your next move, I think, from... Who's that? Hondoom and the Matilda? Yeah. Oh man. I think if you put Matilda out there, he might just flat out die because of the spike stones there. Yeah, that's how I got damaged, the pointed stones. Okay. Crunch, come on, come on, Hondoom, hit it. Yes. There you go, nice. Dirge fainted. Torch Song is such a good move. It's so strong for a fire type with Skillodurge. Did we do it? She's dabbing. Don't worry, she's not having a panic attack. <laughs> you. You did it! This is legit incredible. You're the strongest out there, Kelly. <laughs> I mean, you knocked me flat, and I was giving you absolutely everything I had. Everything I... Yeah, you I... did. <laughs> oh man, Pokemon battling is so much fun. It's so much better, more fun than ever I even knew. Wow! <laughs> Thanks for the incredible match. You beat me for real this time. I'll take that. Give me your money and your friendship. Clap, 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 clap. <laughs> now let's give ourselves a minute and have a quick break, Kelly. Before round two. No, I don't want to do a round two. What did your Pokemon think about me? this? Put it away. Put it away. Yeah. Which Pokemon should I bring out this time? Decisions, decisions. <laughs> ah, the age of 12 to become a master of my craft. <laughs> mm, what a shame. Next world domination. That's right. Wow, we beat him on but barely. That was extremely tough. Yeah. Victory Road. Complete awesome. All right. Let me go bed now. <laughs> We're in our room. Let We're me out! We're in the dorm. Where do you want to go? Anywhere but here. Should we grab a bite? The entrance hall. You want some food? No, I don't want some food. Why? Aren't you hungry? We, we can make sandwiches in this game. We could feed her sandwiches, Kelly. We could feed you sandwiches. You know, I just realized I 
I didn't see if there was anywhere that we specifically needed to go. For... If there was like any quests or something in here. Uh, well, we could ask her if you want to take any classes at all or anything. Where do you want to go? Well, I think if we go down see. the list, there's people to interact there's with in those rooms. There's the director's rooms. office, the nurse's office. I'll go to the director's office just to humor to see if he has anything to say. Okay. I think with that, I mean, it was some dialogue, but it really... Oh, you know what? We had a relationship, right? We can grow with the people here. Yeah. That's what these are for. Ah, oh, Miss Kelly, how kind of you to stop by. I must say I am pleased to see you on school grounds again. Yes, I've been ditching like hardcore. Team Star has been making a good pressure on me. Travel and adventure certainly have their place, but it does one good to attend class as well, no? Speaking of which, there's something I would very much like to ask you. You're expelled. No. <laughs> <laughs> How do you feel about not being here anymore? I understand you have joined a variety of classes during your time here at the Academy. No, I really haven't joined any. I mean, we joined maybe like one. <laughs> I think I've only attended maybe like <laughs> two classes. Yeah, Jacques, he was our main guy, right? Yeah. You, you didn't visit the other five professors we had here? Nope. Nope. Nope, we were off to Team Star for life. But if I may ask, which of our faculty members had made the most favorable impression on you? Oh, oh my God, we only saw like one. We literally only met one. Oh, wait, we, miss, we, we met have, Mr. Hassel. Yeah, we met Mr. Hassel too, but we only met like Jacques. We barely knew Nurse Miriam, like the last few episodes. I Director know. Clavel was Clive. I want to say Mr. Jock. He's great. I liked his He's character. like a homework teacher, right? Yeah. Like, he was there. Oh, Mr. Jock from biology class, you say? Yes, he is a fine teacher, a most earnest and hardworking fellow. We are truly blessed to have so many wonderful teachers and staff members in our job academy. I firmly believe that our faculty is second to none in their commitment to our students' ongoing education and well-being. Thank you very much for sharing your thoughts, Miss Kelly. Been in great. He's like writing down on a piece of paper. Uh, uh, Dr. Jacques, increase uh, pay scale. All right. Uh, everybody else, remain the same. Remain the <laughs> same. 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 All same, right. Same, let's same. get out of here. Because <laughs> honestly, that's what we do for like reviewing packages in the day and age, like with Amazon and making sure that people when they buy things online are credible. Yeah. We get reviews. And they take it serious. People put money for it too. Okay, I think you went through the door. Yes, I did. I heard the creaky door door noise. <laughs> it wasn't like your phone's collapsing <laughs> as you're trying to pass through a door. No. <laughs> All right. Where's your next, Kelly? I gotta get situated. <laughs> the lab on Poco Path to visit our good friend Arden. Fly here, please. Yes. Fly to this spot. I wonder why. You know, before this, do you want to show our progress in the game so far? What we've done, Kelly, as far as like how many Pokemon we caught and like the progress in the paths and stuff, other areas? I guess we could. Poco Path. So we first saw him through that window. Anyway, there's the Pokedex, right? Well, when you click this and then you go to Pokedex. Pokedex. I think you have to click on it again. And then there's this little trophy symbol in the bottom left. I didn't realize that you get rewards as you're filling up your Pokedex. <laughs> so when I finally what? went in here after all this time, I got all no. these rewards. I, that was there the whole time? Yeah, it was and here we, the whole time. We didn't use it at all? We didn't use it at all. Man, bummer. Well, now we have all the extra items we need to in the world. So what? It gave you like a bunch of great balls, a bunch of other like items and stones and things you could use too. And I realized you could actually change your photo in here too. So you can take a new photo if you want. Yeah. With the expressions. Oh man, like a selfie? Peace. Roar. What's this? <laughs> cool. Oh dear. Hello. <laughs> and then you That's can, cool. You can change the eye direction too, I think. You know, I think Legend of Zelda made a big way, Kelly, when they did the selfie in Legend of Zelda 2. I thought you could change the eye direction. Oh, why? No, that's the angle of the camera. It's oh. C rotate. Oh my god. <laughs> Is your hand like breaking? And then there's filters. Oh, I didn't realize it said the filter in the bo the top right. The top right. Toy camera, monochrome. Oh my god, so dramatic. Cool, retro, vivid, dreamy, no filter. <laughs> I think we're pretty cool with our blue and purple scheme we got going on. 
anyway. They look pretty good. Hey, is there a gimme ghoul up here? Guess we're gonna find out. South Province Area 1. I thought Arvin would be up here. He might be inside, I'm gonna say on the first floor, or maybe around the building. Can you just jump off the building? Oh, oh my god, you could. I was just joking. Oh, that's hilarious. Uh, what about... Oh, there's an item right there. You see that? Eerie Impulse. Nice. Oh, another item. Oh, revive. God, we love those revives. Oh! We got a little bug. Oh my god. Time to squash him, Kelly. They're so tiny. Time to squash him. You don't want to. You could just literally eat him if you wanted to watch us. I know. Where is Arden? Like seriously. I think you have to go in. Oh, for whatever reason, I thought there was a room inside. Isn't there a door or something? Like we went up the. We'll thing go on the door. left side. You're not. You're going on every other side besides the left side of the building. Can you go through that doorway. Wait, 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 Kelly, Kelly, go back. Go yeah, back. so trying to go... get off Cryden. Okay, go through that right there. I can't. <laughs> There's a cutscene. <laughs> oh, that's what we had to do. We had to run a little closer to it. Ah. There it is. Seriously? You beat me here? Yep. I'm not fast. I beat the Pokemon League and then came back for you. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is the lab. I used to come here to play all the time when I was a kid. There'd be better, there better be a good reason for calling us here like this. Oh, that's right. We got called back by mom. Yeah, mommy said to come here. Come home now. Let's find out. So angry right now. What she's talking about. Everyone always says she's some kind of genius. Always brilliant as a prof Pokemon professor. My mom, that is. But let me tell you, as a parent, she's the worst. All she ever does is work. She never comes home. Aw, oh, Arvid, do you need a hug? Get lonely, man. A Pokemon that doesn't move a whole lot, I don't really have a whole lot to talk to. I don't have a single memory of her even when playing with me. Her own kid. Mapo's Tiff, the only one who was there for me. I knew it, literally. Always. Well, that's kind of sad. Anyway, it's open now. Go on in. You're not coming in with me, Arvin. You don't want a friend like me to hang out with you? I just want to get this over with. Oh man, sorry to be a Debbie Downer like this. My backpack is so small compared to Arvin's big backpack thing. Do you think he over prepares and he's like super stressful all the time because of it? He probably just goes camping and never comes home. Cause that's me, that, that would make a whole lot of sense actually. It's so dusty in here. Oh. It feels dusty and dim. Mom? It's so dark. Gosh. Who turned on the lights? Hey, yo. I need your help. That seems really dark and ominous. What the? What is going on? I am currently at the deepest point of Area Zero in the Great Crater of Paldea. Okay. I have been researching the unique Pokemon here for a very long time. I'm asking the two of you to lend a hand to help carry out the final step of the great Professor Shada's glorious research. Okay. Us kiddos, huh? The final step? But there is something we need first. Something that can be found within that lab. What we need is the Scarlet Book. Wait, do you mean this book? Ah, so you took it from the lab, did you, Arvin? No, uh -huh. I didn't. I would never it. do that. This expedites things. Bring the Scarlet Book to the deepest depths of Area Zero. I promise that it will be an experience worth treasuring if you come. It better be. I mean, we're gonna go right on. Better get a free sandwich out of this. I must note, however, that Area Zero is both home to vicious Pokemon and outfitted with 
powerful cybernetic security systems. Aww. It seems to me that you might struggle if the two of you were to enter alone. You may take the time to gather some reliable allies before you come, if you feel the need. I will be awaiting you in the deepest part of Area Zero whenever you arrive. She's probably just got a lab built in the center of the crater. Wow, we want to see her on screen in person? Like a celebrity. Area Zero. <laughs> Zero. <laughs> that place is bad news. It was down in the area of zero that Maspos have got wounded in the first place. Down in the great crater of Paldia. In all honesty, I'd be perfectly happy to never see that place again. Are you gonna go? Of course. Oh, of, of course, course I'm, I'm going, going to. to. Yeah. Okay. We might find treasure. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe. Treasure of friendship. Your friendship. I suppose she did ask. And I can't just stand by and watch while a friend heads off into danger on her own. It's so uncool. Aw, thanks, Arvin. So I guess I'm going to. Besides, <laughs> I'm going to give my mom a piece of my mind. I love how he just rolled up his sleeves like that. <laughs> Oh yeah, that'll make you a lot tougher. Time to get Arvin. dirty. Time to get... I'm going to get done with business with my mama. All right then, Krilly. Outside. We're going to have a Pokemon battle to see if we're really ready to head into the Area Zero or not. Mostly see if I'm ready or not. Let's go. All right. I'm ready to wipe the floor with the Arvin. Yeah, we beat a Pokemon champion. Let's see if he's even comparable to the Elite Four. Yeah. Let's see if Arvin's better than the Elite Four. What if he's like four? level like 30 Pokemon? Battle Arvin. Hey, Arvin, you little baby Pokemon. Yeah, you got a little baby Pokemon. Squeeze in, sound like he loses. Maspadev. All right, you ready for a battle, Kelly? As ready as I'll ever be. Yep, we beat everybody else. Now time to beat you. Excellent. You ready to go, right, Maspadev? Oh, woof, woof, woof. Yep, Maspadev says he's ready. Wait, are you sure about this? <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm gonna say. Okay, yeah, I can see why you'd be worried. But my buddy's here bursting with energy. You never know he was so weak just a little while ago. Well, leave me alone. Always whining at me, whining and battling you and your Pokemon. Never hanging out with me or being a friend. It's been so long, I nearly forgot, but he's always did, did love to battle. If we always lost to that student council girl, the battle fanatic one. You mean Nomura? <laughs> yeah, the one and only. My best rival ever. Anyway, my point is there's no need to worry. We're a brand new Arvin and Maspatif, and we're really feeling audacious. Or maybe herbaceous? <laughs> Let me give you a taste of what we can do! Woo. Is he gonna poop his pants? <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah! You're challenged by a Pokemon trainer, Arvin! Green ants. That's a normal type Pokemon. It is I mean, normal type. It is a green type Pokemon. What was I going to say even? Pokemon I met during our hunt for the Herb and Mystica are all stars. Every one of them. Level 58? Okay. Oh. This will be a good challenge then. Dragon Pulse. Discharge. Get electrified. Ooh. All right. No one's paralyzed yet. I'm actually legitimately surprised. Why is that? Luigi always paralyzes. One we've done before. One down. Give us the second one, Arvin. Garganical. I never heard of that one. Another one added to the Pokédex. Oh. Oh. That you might want to change. Maybe to Garchomp? Yeah, maybe Garchomp. <laughs> he looks like a bunch of blocks. I mean, he's like Earth or Rock. 
Stealth Rock. Everybody's using Stealth Rock. It must be a, such a good move. Oh yeah, gotta love the pointy rocks. Mm -hmm. Ah, nuts. Burrowing like a diglet. Body press. Oh, yikes. Nice. Earthquake. Huh. Nothing. Bulldoze. Oh, there yeah. We go. That's what I'm talking about. I thought Kelly. Woo! Boom. Alright, who's next? Toad Scroll. This is the one that looks like the Toad Tentacruel. This one really looks like a turtle. Oh, okay. Okay. It, it's like the, the 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 ground has already been dug. You can't dig anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. That was definitely an interesting move. Maybe Dragon Claw? Crunch? Crunch? Crunch is even better. Nah, flinch? Nope. Oh. How do you have a flinch in this place? I think it almost looks like something from Splatoon, or even Mario, the way it's featured. It kind of looks like a Tentacool, but it's not. Yeah, it's the Peldia version of a Tentacool. A Cloister? Whoa, one from the original series? Okay. Are we even ready to go to Area Zero? We gotta figure this out. Fight me, Kelly! <laughs> Cloister. Wow, look at that. Certain pressure. If it uses an ice move, it might take you out, but hopefully it doesn't. Liquidation. Oh, defense fell. No. That was there a good you go. One. Liquidation looks to be like a special attack, so it doesn't affect the amount of HP you take from all the moves we've been doing. Avoided the attack. Come on. Yeah, you tell him, Kelly. That's unfair, right? We deserve to kill them, right? And you got a white cross. Black cross still alive? Oh, yeah. Bring him out. Let's toss him to the enemy. Uh oh, hope you're faster than the uh, cloister. Hey, we survived. We hung on. Come on, take him out, take him out, take him out. Awesome. There we go. Number four down. Good thing I swapped in an electric type. Yeah, right? Glade, you were good, but no match. Scovillian. I would just keep him out, he's gonna faint either way. If you bring him back out. I suppose. Because then the, the stealth rocks are just gonna dig and kill him. Oh, that one looks so wicked, too. Oh, oh avoided the attack! Avoided the attack. Hey, there you go. That's a good damage. That's some damage. Zen headbutt, don't do more than five damage. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's probably a grass type, so it'd probably be. Yeah, yeah, how do we be a perfect choice? Mm -hmm. Level 60. Awesome. Nice. Roasted those peppers good. I think he has one more. Oh, Mastiff. yeah. Mass Yeah, we'll stick with this. Come on, Kelly, beat his best friend up. Should be a dark type Pokemon, actually. Oh, you're right. Yep. Let's celebrate our full recovery with a glow off. Time to tear us alive, Master Stiff. Yaw. Shine bright, my friend. What are we turns into? That's Whoa. A, that's a dark icon. That is the dark icon? Yes. Oh, that's kind of cool. I don't like it. Oh my so God. he's like a super dark. Wow. Oh, one more kill. He's toast. One more flamethrower. 
Oh, oh, just to show off a little bit here, huh? I gotta give him all I've got! Can I kill him? Yep, I gotta give it all I got. I should say it with me. With an anime character. <laughs> I gotta give it all I got! Woo! No, you do it. I gotta give it all I got. Yeah! There we go. Master Stiff, you are no more. So full of energy, so full of life, so fainted. You defeated Pokemon Trainer Arvin. <laughs> I'm an idiot. <laughs> we were so close, Master Stiff. So close. But Kelly, thanks, little buddy. 12,000. 600. Oh God. I feel like we're just, we're changing the economy of the game with like how much money we're taking for people. We have so much money. Dang, this is the strength of someone who could take down those Titan Pokemon? Huh? Yeah, much as I hate to admit it, I do think we're gonna need some more support. Pokemon Area Zero are super strong, and there are lots of weird machines there too. I'd say we need at least two more po people. Somebody with champion rank level skills. And somebody who could deal with crazy tech. Oh, I know who we're gonna get. So we're gonna get pneumonia and we're gonna get uh we're gonna get Penny. Ooh. Or Cassiopeia. Oh, the game literally just tells us. Alright. The student council president? I was probably right. That girl could take on any Pokemon that comes at her. She's a beast. Huh. Well, seems like you've been busy making some pretty useful friends. I reach out to them and organize things. You just make sure you're there. The main place will be z the Zero Gate. It's this facility out on the edge of the greater Great Crater. I'll send you the info on how to find it, so don't keep us waiting forever. Oh. Okay. okay. All right. Thanks for the picture. <laughs> this is where you go. Uh, all right. Path of Legends, complete. Awesome. All right. Cool. I wonder if you had to literally beat Victory Road and everything else before you could do this part in the game. Maybe. Huh. Hmm. Two more. Oh, right there. Okay. Guess so it's like uh, a dolly, huh? Fly there. That's cool. It is a giant crater. I wonder if the Pokemon are like mutated, like, like abnormally strong or maybe an extra tentacle. Maybe a different color. They're all dinosaurs. Maybe they're just maybe they're just all dinosaurs. <laughs> Welcome to the Pokemon Center. Blah 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 blah. Want us to kiss your Pokemon for you? Mwah. All better. Electros, you've been the best Gallade of our team. Best punching bag. Cool. So Nimona will be there. I wonder if Penny will, because we never really talked about them coming to it. I also forget too that Crydon can climb walls, Kelly. Yes, Crydon can climb walls. Go away, Meowth. Meowth, you are too frightening. We cannot fight you right now. Sorry. Got a jet. That is, it looks like a frog going up the wall. Ribbit? 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 Is this the place? This has to be the pathway. Oh my. Hey! Over here! Kelly! <laughs> Arvin! How you doing? I'm doing good! This is the Zero Gate. It was made so researchers could try to observe the inside of the great crater of Paldea. What folks call Area Zero. So take it down into the crater. Oh, and speaking of the crater, you know that Pokemon of yours? The one I gave you? Area Zero is apparently where Coridon was born, or something like that. Maybe we'll be happy they could finally come home? Not that I really care or anything. Anywhere, our two new teammates should be waiting for us inside the Zero Gate. Guess we should head in. Oh yeah? The way home. Is that what we're calling? I guess we're calling this, this section the way home. 
Going on the way home. The way home quest. <laughs> Mama, are we going to go home? I miss you. You're never there. You even made a freezer meal for me. I had to do everything on my own. I had to make my own food. I had to get all own berries and potions and stuff. I had Pokemon food. It was, it was gross. It's gross and nasty. Whoa, kind of dark in here. Whoa. There's no Mona. Hold it, Kelly. Arvin said there'd be tons of strong Pokemon, so here I am. Hmm. Once she heard there'll be, she'll get to a battle awesome Pokemon. She was here in a second. You're an annoying little pest of the academy, but I guess you could come in handy for this. Spoken like a guy who wants to get beaten in a battle. Ooh. But more importantly, why is it so dark? And where are the awesome Pokemon? Yeah, it is weird that the lights are off. Last time I was here, electricity was up and running, but now... Did... Well, now the lights are on. <laughs> yeah! They I'm are, sorry. Evan! They are! Oh my god! But why? I... I, I turned them on. Penny! Seems like they were on power saving mode. I hacked into the system controls and overrode the settings. Oh, it's you! The kid with the fluffy Eevee bag. Um, I guess? My name's Penny. Well, hey, we never got to actually talk. I'm pneumonia. I'm in class 1A. You must be some kind of tech whiz. Do you like Pokemon battling too? <laughs> er, you talk like way too much. The director introduced us. When you need someone good with tech, she's a no brainer. Anyway, Penny here also agreed in a second when she agreed it was to help Kelly. I'm not really the adventure type, but I owe you, Kelly, and I pay my debts. She's surprisingly old-fashioned like that. And of course, everyone knows me, Arvin. My love includes my basketball and cooking and... Biometric identification in progress. Hello, Kelly. I've been expecting you. Ah. And it seems you have gathered a group of formidable allies as well. Uh, sorry? Who are you? That's my mom. Probably... Not quite sure. Unidentified. What? That's Professor Sarada? Pneumonia student ID number blah 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 and Penny student ID number blah 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 I thank you for coming. Of course, Professor. Oh my gosh, it's such an honor to meet you in person. I mean, maybe not in person exactly. <laughs> Arvin, did you uh, tell your mom about us? When would I have done that? To begin with, I'd like to ask you all to make up your way down into the great crater of Peldia. You can reach the lower chamber using the elevator you can see to your right. Um, Mom? Please proceed below. Just completely uh, ignores Arvin, wow! Yo, what a great parent. Are they not on good terms? Must not be. If you knew the importance of research, maybe she's. The, it's that much more important, you know? Who knows? Parents do sacrifices all the time for their kids. Maybe there's something in the back when we don't know. Did she realize that she didn't have a son? <laughs> yeah, right? Was it, was it a daughter or a girl instead? It's windy down here. Biometric identification in progress. Identities confirmed. Is she really a computer in disguise? Access granted to lower level. Ooh, it opened for us automatically. Not quite. Looks to me like someone's controlling this thing remotely. 
Once you step through, you will be above Area Zero. Kelly, you have brought Crichton with you. Yeah, <laughs> pretty in much. My pocket. I thank you for bringing it with you on your many adventures. It? It's a Pokemon! Yeah, come on, it has a gender, right? If you utilize Coridon's the gliding of capabilities, you should be able to descend into the depths to reach Area Zero. Oh. What? Isn't there, like, an elevator or something? And wait, did you say Coridon could fly? When you reach the bottom, I will get in touch once again. I hope your trip is uneventful. Railroading people into stuff, just like always. I can't wait to see what Pokemon live down in Area Zero. Let's go! That girl, is she, like, incapable of fear or what? Yep, just plunges right in, pure adrenaline. That's right, let's go. All the time. Yep, thank you. Let's walk. Let's walk. I guess we better go, too. Yeah, are we all going to go on Crydon's back or do they have all their own flying Pokemon? <laughs> are we just going to, like, are they going to, like, parachute? You can't ride Crydon here. Are we going to get a cutscene? Kelly, ready for the worst? Ready as all ever be. Let's do it. Good. That's all we needed to hear. Get out that Pokemon of yours and we'll be off. Are we all going to ride Crydon? I was, I was just like, seriously, are we going to all ride Crydon? I want to see this. Like, seriously. Is Crime just going to push us off? <laughs> yeah, it's just going to make us fall to our death. <laughs> Akia! <Ach -yah! laughs> What's the matter? What's That's the your... matter with it? Hmm. Scared of heights. That's what I'd say. Well, no wonder. But no need to be scared if we go together. Are we pushing him off slightly ever and ever? Yeah, it seems that way. Get on! Oh my god, are we just gonna... No, grab her hand! Grab her hand! Thank you. Yeah! Oh my god! <laughs> we just barely flew there, <laughs> my god! Really? Oh, okay, I'm <gasps> like... How can we not... Oh god, fly on the seat! Whoa! I'm so glad we were able to be seated on there. I thought we were going to fly off. <laughs> I know! I'm just like, we barely got on crack before we <laughs> went over the edge. See at the bottom! Ah! Arno was pretty strong to like kind of pull us to the front and just put us down. My goodness. He looks like a stick. How could we be, how could we be so strong as being a survivalist? Wow. You know, it looks really unique down here though too, doesn't it? Lots of tall walls. It looks nice, like habitable. And now I'm back here again. Oh, did you used to live here, Arvin? Ha huh, ha. Huh. I think I might have died once or twice there. Agiya. <laughs> it's okay, bud. Yes. Whoa. Is he gonna go, like do his power mode? Oh. Chose to go back into its ball? It's probably just hungry or something. Where did Ammonia go, by the way? She's nowhere to be found. She's probably on ahead without us. Hmm. Wait a second. Where's the student council girl? That's what I was just wondering. Where? What? She's gone. You don't think she... Everyone! You have to see this! Area Zero is amazing! <laughs> Come on already! I guess your ability would be on tempo, huh? Biometric identification in progress. Four humans identify. Condition satisfactory. Vital signs all within normal range. It appears you were able to make, to make the descent without being harmed. Uh, yeah, sure. Smooth sailing. Who could possibly complain about a landing like that? That is good. <laughs> I feel like this is literally a computer just talking to us. I know, right? I had concerns you might fail, given the crudeness of the only available access method. Hmm? I think your mom's sarcasm detector needs fixing. Aw, you were worried about us? That's so sweet. You should now make your way to me at 
the Zero Lab, in the deepest part of Area Zero. However, the entrance to the lab is buried by four locks installed on the X here, which I cannot unlock. Okay. Four locks? On your way to me, you must visit four research stations that were constructed inside the crater. Okay. Okay. Each station, you will be able to disable one of the locks. Do so as you make your way down. I hope you succeed. Okay. Yes! Let's disable the four locks and get into that lab! Sounds kind of video gamey when you say it out loud, huh? Oh, gosh, this is a little video gamey. Might be kind of a puzzle, Basil. <laughs> Come on, time to find our way to the deepest part of Area Zero. Let's go. Find your mom, Arvin. <laughs> it looks very hospital down here and very habitable. All right, you. All right, you. Woo. I'm just going to... I can't write right in here all things. Uh oh, he's too he's too scared, Kelly. You can't write the crane in here. I guess we We gotta baby him a little walking. bit. Walking. What's with that tree? I don't know. So this is the inside of the great crater of Paldi. It feels different from inside your textbooks. It's so intense. Wow. Oh my god. And there's a lot of strong Pokemon here. Oh my goodness. They always come through the flying taxi real sob story. Don't get along or something? I hear business people speak. Uh oh. Put your subject. It's adventure. Let's have a good time. I agree. No, since they're bringing drama up. Corbin Knight! Corbin Knights. Oh my god. Uh, I wonder what the sparkly, what the little sparkles and the glitters are. I have no idea. So, Penny, how'd you become friends with Kelly anyway? You can't come off the edge. You don't want to cry on you, Goose. Can you do that? Yeah, I'll be fine. Look, my phone's gonna catch me. Oh my god. <laughs> I totally forgot about that. You're heading back to the earth so you wouldn't get separated. Are you kidding me? I'm telling you, I have to walk down the old fashioned way. Oh, well, you have to hear the story. But whatever they're talking about, too, I guess. Did that just bring us back to where we were at the start? I think so. Oh, they're just the right shoes, yep. Well, careful, too. It looks like the game might be kind of slow loading some of the features in here. So, Penny, how'd you wind up friends? It's kind of going too fast for us to really talk about yeah. or anything. So we became friends with helping and being friends and everything. It was a great time. God, classmates. Neighbors back home too. We're pretty much like blood relatives. That's wild. You know, and I bet some of the Pokemon too, you can only find an area of zero compared to other parts of the world too. I'm trying to flex on us. <laughs> We're all friends with Kelly, our lord and savior of the game, right? We all love to be friends with Kelly. The power of friendship. So we have to go to these four labs, huh? Oh, I bet that's what we were looking for. Mm -hmm -hmm. That must be one of the buildings the professor was talking about. Oh yeah, what were they called? Radish rations? <laughs> <laughs> Research stations. Hmm. Well, I was close. <laughs> yeah, not really. <laughs> wow, you have such a great memory, Penny. That's great in my common sense compared to you lot, apparently. Shireen! Yeah! What the heck is that? Our worst enemy. That's a Pokemon La Prima uses! I didn't know that species could be found in the Great Crater. Come on, Kelly, let's take it on together. Let's catch it more likely. So we're gonna have to catch it? Gleema! Yes! 
Lima, huh? I don't know what type it is. It must be like a fairy type or something. Oh, both! 62. It is pretty tough. Whoa. Oh my god! Namorna just pulverized it, my goodness. <laughs> Let's fight it. JK. <laughs> I didn't have to do anything! My no. god! Was well, that just to show that we could do a double battle? I guess so. <laughs> Are there going to be a lot more of these rare Pokemon down here, you think? I think that was something, please. You've got no idea how terrifying Area Zero really is. Wow, patronizing much? Easy, you two. Let's just head inside the research station. Agreed. You know, I bet each one of these stations were probably meant to fight um, around a Pokemon, I'm guessing. Probably. It's a blue lab. I'm um, like, we turned around to surprise, like, ooh, an entrance. This is where you go in, huh? Detecting bio li biometric life forms. Please give me your blood. Wow, are these ancient ruins? They look far too recent for that. It appears you have reached your first research station without incident. This facility was constructed 87 years ago as a way station for those surveying Area Zero. So that's why there's a bed. <laughs> Looks like we can use this place to rest up if we need to. Kelly, if you would be so kind as to disable the first lock on the lab using the central panel. You got it, boss. We're on it. The first lock, huh? Yes. Uh, yeah, let's Push do it. Push the button. Better press it. Black disabled. Three of four locks are still active. Well done. Please continue your efforts at the remaining research stations. Hmm. I'm really curious if she's trapped or if there's something else that we don't know about yet. Really curious. I like it because this whole time I thought, I don't know, maybe she is. I, I don't know. I'm debating whether she's robot or person. Or machine. It's hard to tell. I almost never saw my mom in real life. Backstory, backstory reveal? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Always busy with her, never home. I think you're going the right way, Kelly. I think you're going backwards now. I mean, we came from that direction, so I was assuming we just kind of go down. Yeah. Th that's what my guess would be, too. Because I thought too. this was a dead end over here. It looks that way to me. Anyway. Huh? No, no, no. You can keep going forward. You just go past the research center, I think. Unless I'm mistaken, but I think you can. All these Venomoths. So poisonous. Yeah, <laughs> I shouldn't I, have stamped it to I like that. I think you could go further down on this side. You can. I have to believe, Kelly. You have to believe you can go further down. And the path will light itself up for you. I'm kind of just trying to think if there's a run button on here or not. I can't remember. Uh, aren't you running? I thought it could run faster than this. <laughs> I, I don't know. I thought you looked at it in your direction. Can you like tap it down? Can you push it in or something? No. Oh. Okay. Well, I guess not. Our bike is gone. We used to have a bike all the time throughout the world, and now we don't have a bike. Ah, this feels so weird. I definitely like this, though, a lot. This is an interesting crater where there's just so many different things. That by some kind of creature I've never seen before. Like a Pokemon? Crazy about rampaging sort of thing. Oh. Huh. Interesting. I think it'll be okay if you go down it. I mean, we're just kind of sliding down. I couldn't see why they just couldn't follow. I'm just really surprised that... Why would we go back to such a dangerous place? After everything we've been through, I guess. I think everyone will have more background about what's going on. 
End of the lab, I see one. I spy with my little eye something L. What is it, Kelly? A lab. You got it, nice going. It's like a good research station, about time too. That's right. We've walked all this way with all crayon giving us a boost. Phew, Let, let's head in and take a breather. I thought you'd have a bit more stamina, student council girl. Hey, hey, ho! Oh, I'm just full of surprises. <laughs> that wasn't a compliment, you know. <laughs> I love how I'm just smiling there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know, such a white smile. Ooh. What? Hey, look, a Jigglypuff. It's good to see some nice familiar Pokemon down here, too. It looks so weird. It does look weird. What is that? <laughs> poop, poop! Oh my gosh, so cute! We're gonna have to fight it, I bet. Yeah, probably. Poo! <laughs> Poo -ah! Oh no! What? What the? Kelly, it's battle time! Oh, you don't say. <laughs> Let's rough him up! It does look cute, though. It does. Oh, does it mean we're gonna have to battle, like, along with our friends every stage down here? Every lab? Interesting. You think the mortis is gonna Penny annihilate Penny a T-Star sent out, you see that? Screamtail? You're gonna hurt on Bram when you do that, too. Oh, wow. Well. I guess Penny won't care. Best. It's already a full HP. Screamtail. This is interesting. I never thought I'd see a mutant like Pokemon. Wild Screamtail. It's because this one hasn't been like properly named. This is how we kind of name Pokemon first off by their features. I guess so. Okay. Oh, Drain doesn't affect him. Or them. He's in rest. Okay. Alright, so restored its HP, that's cool. But now it's asleep, so I'd be take advantage of it. Uh I guess you can't really tell what's effective and what's not until you really try it out. Corviknight. So now we have two dark types out, so hopefully we're effective against it. At some point. Fast asleep. <laughs> Fast asleep. Okay. There you go. This is a good amount of damage. Don't tell me it's gonna wake up and then do like rest again. Oh my. Not a very effective good choice. Can you catch it, you think? No, I can't. There's no option for it. You can go to your bag and... Nope, I can't. Oh, okay. I wish I could catch it, it'd be kind of cool. Catch a mutated Pokemon. <laughs> yeah. That was cool, I've never seen something like that before. You're right, Arvin. It is pretty crazy down here. Wants to learn Brave, Brave Bird. Brave Bird, finally! Awesome! It only took to the level 83. Huh, huh. Quick attack. Wait. I suppose I could do quick attack. I yeah. never really use that attack besides when I'm trying to catch low level Pokemon, actually. Well, plus Acrobatics is a better version of that, too, and better damaging. We'll be the best bird, the brave bird. Nice. Cool. That was interesting. Our first one was that one that champion had. Seriously, what was that? Darth they scared me half to death. You're the one who approached it, Benny. Yeah, no kidding. It was definitely kind of ferocious for a Jigglypuff, wasn't it? No kidding. Come on, let's get inside already. One more jump scare like that and I'm done for. My heart will explode out of my chest. I can't risk it. Let's get inside. Interesting. This is... This is just makes it more and more curious, I guess, for me. I like this a lot, even though this is really weird. 
Well, this looks pretty much the same as the first research station. Mm-hmm. It seems like wild Pokemon don't come here. We should be safe to catch our breath. Hey, seriously, what is this place? That Pokemon. I've been wondering about that myself. I think maybe that the Pokemon was one of these? Huh? What is that book? Aries of Monster Zero. One of the teams suffered a brutal blow from a beast that was mortally wounded, forcing us to retreat for a time. Oh, those are the ones that we found mm -hmm. for the HM skills. I noticed of a team captured by the photographer by chance. I noticed the passing resemblance of the Pokemon known as Donphan. The differences such as its sheer size and shape of its back set it apart. So they aren't actually Pokemon? I don't really know. What do you think, Kelly? I, I don't I, think they're regular Pokemon. Yeah, I don't think they're regular Pokemon. Hmm, maybe. They definitely do look different, at least. And I've never seen any of them in the Pokedex, either. It's true. I suppose the time has come for an explanation. <gasps> the Deets? Professor? Some of the life forms that you see residing now within Area Zero are ancient Pokemon that lived in a distant past. Long lost to us. Oh. Ancient Pokemon? What? That's awesome! Oh, come on. There's... No way that's possible! The Zero Lab, where am I located, contains a time machine. Oh my god. It summons the ancient Pokemon to this place. You fucking have a time machine? So the thing my mom spent forever researching down there? She actually got it working? Indeed. Though the cost was catastrophic. The cost? But a time machine? You mean you actually travel to and from the past? It is theoretically possible to travel to the past. However, for a being such as a human, it would not be possible to return to the present. Well, that's horrifying. Does that mean Arvin's mom used the time machine and that's why he hasn't seen her his entire life? Maybe. Mom, you... Why do you call us here to Area Zero? Arvin, I... Dot, dot, dot. If possible, I would like us to speak when we can meet face to face. It'll be easier for you to understand once you see the situation for yourself. Okay. I'm starting to get the picture now. Now then, Kelly. Please use the central panel here to disable another lock on my lab. I'm starting to get a clearer picture about what actually is going on and what's happening. With this one, it's a big opening to it. Crystal's power is tremendous. Their unstable output made our corporate back, uh, back, backers fret, but if we can harness this energy, it will open up research possibilities we'd only dream of. At last, Paradise will be ours to create. Oh, they're harnessing the energy for it, huh? Okay. Press it. Better press it. Two out of the four is still done. Well done. Please continue your efforts at the remaining research stations. Hey, Kelly. You know that book she told me to bring? I think it's got something to do with this place. Or more like everything to do with this place. But I'm not the one she expects to fix whatever all this is. You are. I think you should be the one to carry it. Got the Scarlet Book, okay. Awesome. In the bag of key items. Okay. Clumsy handwriting. <laughs> Take care of it for me. Okay, Kelly? Okay, Arvin. It's a precious gift that I got from my mom, okay? All right. Well, hey, thank you for joining us here today on Pokemon Scarlet as we join here in Area Zero. Join us next time as we continue to do more into Area Zero, unlocking the locks and unlocking more of the mysteries here in Pokemon Scarlet and what happened in the past, future, and maybe present. Until then, I've been Zelly. And I've been Kelly. And we'll see you in the last one. Bye bye Bye! Hey, Kelly, they stayed to the end. I know, Zelly. I think they like us. Like, subscribe, or share to show us you care. Bye-bye.